We're starting today off two hours south from uh, where we live. We are currently in Charleston, South Carolina. Now, I'm not going to say that we came here exclusively to continue to search for shoes, but we are searching for shoes. But we're also taking care of, you know, some Christmas gifts and things like that. We don't get down here too often, but it's, it's a very beautiful, historic city. It's a lot like Savannah, but with different trees. Right here is the, uh, the Art Institute of Charleston. Whenever I was deciding on schools, I actually applied to both Art Institute and SCAD. I got accepted to both. Ultimately decided to go to SCAD, but uh, if, if I wouldn't have gone, this would have been my next choice. We're currently at the, uh, the city market in Charleston. It's kind of like a flea market type thing of sorts. Um, they actually used to sell slaves here, and obviously that's long past, but we, uh, it's mostly used for selling knickknacks, candy, and lots of uh, woven baskets, of all things. Charleston is a, a very beautiful city. Me and, me and Mallory actually came here. We actually rode up one day, uh, probably about a little over a year ago, because I remember it was right before I started doing the vlog. I know that because I actually looked for it on the vlog one time and realized that it was before I started doing it, but there's pictures on Flickr. Um, she really likes this place. We'd live here if it wasn't so dug on expensive. While we're down here, we're going to be visiting a Puma store, which is actually where we're heading now. Um, I've never worn a Puma shoe before, but Mallory suggested that I try it because it, it's for narrow feet. Um, one thing about them is that they're low tops, and I always wear high tops. And it's because I have such narrow feet, because they, they just don't, shoes don't stay on my feet very well unless they're high tops. So, it's going to be a little weird trying a low top, but uh, I'm willing to give it a shot, especially since... I looked at some of their shoes online and they look really nice. And uh, finding shoes that are catered for narrow feet, that's that's a good thing. Hopefully they're catered for big feet too. I don't think they're going fine, are they? Surprisingly, they had nine pairs of uh, size 14 Pumas, two of which I loved. I put them on. The shoes are narrow, they're great, they fit really well. Except, ironically, even for being a narrow shoe, they were too wide in one spot, and my, my foot was wiggling around in there, and I was like, you got to be kidding me. They were wonderful. They were awesome shoes. So, for right now, we're stopping and getting some lunch at my favorite place to eat in Charleston, the Kickin' Chicken, home of cheese-filled pretzels. This, to me, is like the reason for coming to Kickin' Chicken. These are pretzels, Parmesan pretzels, that have cheese inside of them, and you dip them in ranch. They are heavenly. Oh my lord. I've never, I've, I've tried other cheese spilled pretzels and like these just blow everything out of the water. I'm getting a chicken sandwich, but it's going to pale in comparison to what this is. I'm just looking for 14s, period. It's been several hours. No luck. But, I feel like we're on the verge of a breakthrough. Because I'm, I'm, I've actually tried shoes on today. And that's a good thing. So we're we're going to leave the downtown portion of Charleston, and we're going to head up to the north end and go to the mall there. Uh, and that's going to be, you know, our last hope in terms of trying to find shoes. You have to understand. I mean, I don't mind ordering shoes off the internet, but because my foot is so narrow, I really, really need to try them on. So it's kind of imperative that I find them in a store and see what they actually feel like. So, I really hope we can find some at the mall. Also, I don't think I've ever shown this jacket, but I refer to this very lovingly as my hobo coat, and uh, I feel like I kind of look like a homeless man in it, and I'm okay with that. I'm going in black. I've gotten two pairs that I, I, I'm kind of somewhat happy with. Also, these shoes are huge. The feet like boats thing is true. But uh, the, I, these are pretty nice. I, I don't mind these. I like gray. And uh, these are pretty good too. That didn't work at all. Those were the most uncomfortable shoes I've ever worn. Let's try Skechers. I can't wear Skechers. This is very discouraging and aggravating on so, so, so many levels. I don't understand why I, my only option should have to be a high-top black basketball shoe. 
I mean, if I want a low top brown uh, skate shoe, no way, not gonna happen. 14, pff, I feel really bad for anyone who has size 15 feet. I feel really sorry for those people because I've seen like one pair all day and it, it looked like it was a clown shoe. I did it. I got shoes. And it feels good. Now very unfortunately, Reebok was actually having a, a buy one get one 50% off sale. And I looked. I tried. And I couldn't do it. There was only one pair of shoes that would work. Um, so, so much for the sale, but I've got shoes. What can I say? You know what, Rocco? I think maybe we got them just a size too small for you.